different. Forensic said that my mother, you know, she was sitting in the chair in the left side of the living room. There was a gun hole through, a bullet hole through the back of a recliner chair. And it struck my mother in the back of the room. And, you know, they used to argue and fight every single day, you know. My mom did drugs. And he had a steady job, so he would buy her drugs. Doing drugs and leaving, but he couldn't take it. So I guess he killed her, you know. You were here when this happened? No, I was not here when it happened. Matter of fact, she was missing for, you know, two weeks. It was on the news, everything, you know. I interviewed my, grand my uh, great grandma and my sister. <coughs> and she was a missing person, you know, for two weeks. But yeah, I got a lot of hate, you know, for this house. If I could burn it down right now, I would. So without a question, this is the most defining moment of your life. Because I was just, you know, I was just a nerdy little kid with that red book. I didn't know how to hate. Would you say this is what you're coping with when you write your music? Yeah, this is what I'm coping with. It's head been heavy on my heart, you know. 30 years old and then, you know, it still wears on me certain times of years, you know, Mother's Day, birthday, you know, I really don't want to be around people. What are some memories that you have of this house and being here? Uh, I remember one day, me and my cousin, Ren, we got dropped off. They were fighting, my mom and her boyfriend, and uh, we missed him. Uh, beat him up. And we, we left walking, me, my mom, and my cousin. He could have shot us there. He could have tracked us down and shot us. But, uh, you know, we walked all the way to town. And then another memory, I remember getting dropped off over there. Wait, no, I was in the room. And, it hit me. and I come out, and he was on top of me with a big, you know, a big knife. Stuck about a quarter inch in the chest. I pushed him off. And he looked me in my eyes and said, One day, I'm going to kill your mother. You're not going to be around. I'm not going to do it in front of you. older I would have told somebody about it, you know, and that wears on me too. And he was just shooting at the door. And somehow I managed to crawl out of a storm window and run and use the neighbor's phone and I called my uncle. Sometimes I feel like if I would have called the cop, you know, my life would be different. Who never thought that I would make it this far, this far from the land where you got the grind hard. Never thought I had keys to a car, to a car or a house I could have been behind bars. Behind bars. Who never thought that I would make it this far, this far from the land where you got the grind hard. Who never thought I had keys to a car, to a car or a house I could have been behind 